I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. I promise to do my best to treat everyone fairly. I promise to do my best to be kind to everyone, even though they're not like me. If I see somebody, someone being hurt or bullied, I will tell a teacher. Everyone should be, should be able to feel safe and happy in school. I want our school to be no place for hate. Did you know Cookie Mod Kingdom is a game about cookies? It's also an action game. This February, actually starting on January 28th, we will be participating in a school wide STEM challenge. This STEM challenge will be focused on famous African American inventors. We did something like this last year. And I'm, I thought it would be great to repeat it again this year. Let's find out more about some of the projects that you all did last year so you can get an idea of what you might want to do. Here is an example of a stoplight. This one was done by a first grader. Here is an example of a mailbox that was made by someone in second grade. Looks like they used cardboard and construction paper. Here's one that was done by a fifth grader. They used cardboard and made a clock. This one was done using Lego. They made a stoplight. Here's another invention that used Lego. This was a golf tee. Here's a fountain pen. This second grader used paper to make it. For the project, on Friday at 3.30, you will receive a notice from Seesaw. You will have from now until February 28th to complete the project. These are the different ways that you can complete your project. You can make a photo, make a drawing, record a video. You can upload a picture from your files, type notes, or if you're able to, create a link. These are all the different ways that your project will be able to be posted into Seesaw. You can use anything you have at home to complete this activity. If you want items from the STEM lab, please write them down on a piece of paper with your name on it and have your teacher place your list in your mailbox. I'll get them to you as soon as I can. Lastly, I want you to have fun with this project because the, the prize for this project will be something that was created by a famous African American. So you'll have to find out what that is later. We'll talk more. Good luck, all stars. Thank you for all you do and happy building. Hi boys and girls, so Miss Flagging and I went around the school to the third, fourth, and fifth grade classes and we have a winner for each grade level. For third grade, it's Miss Vinanen's class. They had 765 grams. Mr. Fritz had 770. Miss Lefkowitz and Miss Pulliam were tied with 906 grams. For fourth grade, it's Miss Marsicek at 150 grams.
Miss Barrett came in second with 240 grams, and Miss McKenna's class came in third with 453 pounds on um, grams. Now, for fifth grade, it was a close race, but let's find out who's going to be the winner. It's Miss Bai, who only had 150 grams. Miss Casalingo came in second with 160 grams, and Miss Hinkson came in third with 180 grams. Classroom teachers, be on the lookout for some information from Miss Flaggy and myself to find out when the winning classes will be able to come to either STEM or, or the PE room to have some extra fun time. We're gonna, con let's continue reducing our waste all stars so that we can be a great sustainable school with less trash. Go all stars. Go all stars.
Peace out, all stars. Peace out, all stars. Remember to always wear your mask like this.